Hey, yo, what up? I'm one Eye Gamer, and I'm here with my pal. Special Eddie. This is our first time doing this, calm, and we're doing this together about all the glitches in this dang frustrating ass game. Ah! This list is in not no particular order. Okay. Here we go. So we're gonna talk about the revive gun glitch. You guys know you can get the revive gun glitch inside of any really gas station. You can find the stems. You can actually get that revive gun, go underwater, and not die at all. No, God, please, no! All you have to do is hold out the revive gun, and you will not drown. I've had many instances, unfortunately, I don't have them on video, trying to fight this team, and then they just go underwater, and I don't know where they're at, and they just disappear just because of a revive gun glitch. Honestly, ridiculous, and they really need to patch that. And honestly, in my personal opinion, I haven't really encountered it. I know that there's a plethora of bugs. Let me tell you about jacked up thing number two. I encountered when I'm jumping through a window, I actually mantle to whatever's on top of that window. So like there might be a little bit of uh, fabric or whatever that kind of covers the window. I actually try to jump to the window and instead of jumping to the window, I literally mantle on top of that. It frustrates the crap out of me. It's frustrating. How about you, Ed? The pinging is really messed up. Like, the pinging is so bad in this game. I'm playing with a team, especially when I'm playing with a team, it is so important for your ping to work. You'll be pinging enemies, you'll be pinging the loadout. It's honestly really important for your pings to work. Whenever you ping and you check up on, like, where it shows it's your compass and you check your compass, you can't even see your ping on your, your compass. You cannot find it for some reason. Actually, You're it's small. Yeah, it's really small. The, yeah, the pings are small. It's just the pings are messed up, man. They really need to be fixed. Add to that, though, uh, with the pings, Sometimes when you're directly looking at your partner or whatever guy may be there, like the pings kind of tend to like ghosts, more transparent. And they're just like a tiny little sliver, like really small sliver. I can't understand when you ping something somewhere. Why has it got to be so small? It's like a tiny, tiny little itty bitty triangular V or whatever it is. And it's frustrating. Another frustrating thing in this game, you know. But to add to that, when you're diving out of a plane, I don't know how many of you guys encounter this issue. Uh does that like ADFOV kind of glitch? I don't know. Maybe it's supposed to be that way. But like when you're inside a plane, it kind of looks zoomed in. Like the ground is really close. And when you dive out, it kind of zooms out. No idea why this can, can keep it consistent like they do in Warzone 1. It's just complete, complete garbage. What about you, Ed? Uh, I really think the TTK or the time to kill in this game is absolutely too fast. I could be running in a field, right? And we already know this game is so slow. And I have nowhere to hide. And this guy has an RPK with a 100 round mag. Kills me in four shots, five shots. The TTK is way too fast. Like pistol, bro. I think it's so unfair. I drop down. Let's say this happens to me too. I'm dropping down on a building and this guy's flying in. I kill him in like six shots with a pistol while he's in air. And it's like, you have no fighting chance to win. It's just unfair. The TTK needs to be needs to be fixed in whatever way. Making SMGs. Make the guns more balanced. Yeah. The SMGs are more people. ARs. Destroy people too. It's, you know, the only thing that they kind of fixed was the snipers. But then they made the guns worse and made the SMGs worse and the RPGs worse. Same with the SMGs and ARs, but they just do more damage and the snipers don't do any. It's messed up. What about you, one? Uh, I have to add to that, you know, there's some jacked up stuff going on. I have no idea. Sometimes I'm, it's, it's almost instantaneous sometimes when we die to certain SMGs and you, you literally spectate them. They're just like, oh, what is going on? The inconsistencies with this game, sometimes I know we've heard about some inconsistencies with, even though people get melted, the inconsistencies with, I guess, some people are sitting there saying that there's skill-based matchmaking, uh, you know, that are, I guess, you know, everybody knows there's a patented out. There was some years back, there was a patented put out and they nerf you live with that and to even kind of even the fights out. So when you want the fights a little more even, that has to add to it. I, I have no other kind of reason that time to kill would be crap and sometimes but yet in others it would just be completely just not you know what i mean you're over there putting a the whole damn clip into another issue that i'm having and you know what ed is a young guy how old are you ed i'm 18 years old ed's ed's 18 and me um you know i'm up there he's up I'm there, sit there and say I'm ancient, <laughs> but i'm up there one thing that i have an issue with is i i love the fact of fov and now that they got console with fov i love the fact of fov but one of the problems i'm having with fov is at certain points some certain skins when they go in dark areas you can't really see them it's kind of like uh rose skin 2.0 rose skin in general I, I don't know maybe i'm just old and i only got one eyeball so i can only see out of my right eye but uh i'm having issues with seeing certain times these guys look like ants like i don't know like i love the fov but it's just so like i don't know how to it's just i'm old i i, I don't know i don't know what else to say i'm old so <laughs> What about you, Ed? No, actually, to add to that, I don't think you're old. I actually think it's the game. I, I Like, a lot of the skins, like, I'm not lying. Either I have bad eyesight, too, but 
I get killed from a guy that's like really close to me, but I don't see him at all. Like I, I have to agree with him. I don't. Sometimes I just don't see people. So some other problems. I'm sure, you guys have had this problem too, where you're trying to join your friend, or you're trying to uh, invite your friend, but either you can't find your friend on your friends list, or they're locked and you can't uh, invite them. That's super frustrating because then you have to restart your game. They have to restart their game, and it, it works or it doesn't work. It's it's really weird and it's just really annoying when you're trying to invite someone and it's locked or you can't even find them. We've all run into that issue. Uh, another issue that we're having in this, this godforsaken game. The problem with the aim assist and the slowdown of aim assist. I understand some people don't, may not have had this issue, but I have. So let me explain a little bit to you. Um, what happens is this is your enemy. Um, your enemy's right here. And you're right, you know, right here. What happens is you try to aim your gun at them at the exact same time when they move. The aim assist won't allow you to aim and, I guess, move towards them. What happens is it allows you to move at the exact same time as the person. So in other words, they end up shooting you and you don't end up shooting them because and I play on 18. I was playing at 2020 and sensitivity, but I'm on 1818 now and still I'm having the exact same problem. So, I mean, it's it's an issue with me. I don't know how many people have find that issue, but it's an issue with me. I've known it. I've, it doesn't happen in Warzone 1, but it's happening warzone 2 what about you ed what other issues you got there's a lot more uh one of the other issues i have this happens in warzone but in a different way but in a completely different way in a multiplayer to where you go into a match and you just have 10 frames or if you're playing snd or it just happens randomly you spawn in and you have 10 frames and it's like you see like your overlay where you're supposed to see your your kills where you're supposed to see uh like your score streaks or whatever it is you're supposed to see that stuff on your screen and nothing pops up and it's just a plain screen just showing the gameplay and it's just 10 frames per second and you have to die for it to come back as regular fps and seeing everything and kind of what happens on warzone is your, the server's just really laggy you know what i'm saying that's actually one of my other problems is the servers are really laggy in warzone and they need to fix them what about you one for me i just want to talk about the ghosting bullets or bullet hit detection and this could be related to was a thing that was a while back a tick rate they call it a tick rate um and i think that our typical call of duty warzone servers are like a 20 tick rate um there's more specifics and in going into it unfortunately i don't have the link for it i don't know for the life of me what it is but call of duty let's just face it call of duty doesn't like to update their stuff they like to update it but not get new it's kind of like us if we want a better experience on gaming we buy a better computer or better console but if you want a crappy one gonna stick to the old playstation 4 original or maybe even playstation 3 if you could somehow manage to play <laughs> games in there but yeah the tick rate on there is garbage so the hit detection is garbage sometimes you just got bullets and it you know you, sh you know you shot 10 bullets but only three of them hit so you're like wondering am i just crap at the game or is it just the freaking garbage ass hit detection because tell you what the hit detection you're being nerfed live man i'm telling you you're being nerfed live that patent hit wasn't lying you're being nerfed Hive. What about you, Ed? This is kind of like a personal issue. I think it's more personal than uh, maybe uh, a game glitch. But the pistol reticle, when you're, especially in the gulag, and you have those freaking revolvers. Don't even get me started on those things. Uh, in the gulag, when I'm aiming down, I can't see the enemy when I'm trying to, especially with the revolvers or the, the, the Desert Eagle. I call it the Desert Eagle, but it's the 50 cal pistol. I'm trying to shoot them, but I cannot see them because the reticle's so big, and I'm just missing all my shots. I just really have to like kind of no scope when I'm shooting those, those, you know, revolvers and stuff. And, and like, I think, I really think the reticles are too big on these pistols. Do you have any problems with that one? Yeah, I honestly haven't had a problem with the reticles, but I mean, each Pacif own specifically, in this game. yeah, but specifically for the pistols, like not the ARs or nothing, but it's just really the pistols. You know what I'm saying? I think maybe what it is, is the, I think you're talking about the lines that are on there. They're a little bit too yeah. fat. I yeah, guess. a little too fat. Yeah, yeah exactly. Uh, I guess, man, I guess, I guess they can get in the way. Um, I more or less think that guns in this game for the pistols like this and the gulag are garbage. But I mean, the gulag itself is a garbage place. But you know what, boys? This is going to, we're going to conclude this part one. We're going to have part two coming on really quick. But part one was just this little bit. We don't want to go too far with like going 40 minutes. But yeah, part one for this. And then stay around for part two. Don't forget to hit that like button. Hit that yep. sub button on my channel and then channel. You're going to see this on both channels because yep. guess what? We're teaming up here to do oh, yeah. and bring this to you. So up. hit that love button. 
yep. slap that like button slap it show how much you appreciate all this crap that's going on and if you had any glitches or any jacked up kind of scenarios put it down below so yeah. that way we know what to comment on next and uh, maybe we'll highlight your comment for next one yeah anything else to say to ed no that's it man just like and subscribe man yeah if you don't hit that love button it's here for no reason no reason <laughs> yeah anyways <laughs> that'll be us and we're right. pretty much out yeah. you guys have a great one peace